In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix Valorant slow loading or stuck on loading screen. So there's a few things you can do and I'm going to show you all of them. So the first one is to simply restart Valorant, okay? And the way you do this, if you're inside the loading screen, you simply have to press Alt plus F4 on your keyboard, which will close Valorant, okay? Now, if that didn't work, you want to go to your task manager. You can go down here to taskbar, right click, click task manager. And then you want to look for Valorant for the game. And then you want to click on it and press end task over here. And this will close down Valorant for you. And of course, as I wrote over here, you have to do the same thing for the Riot client. So you have to look for Riot client. And then when you find the right client, you want to press end task. And this will close down Valorant for you completely. Then you want to simply open it up again. And this may fix your issue. Now, if it doesn't, you want to run the game as administrator. Okay. And the way you do this is simply by right clicking on the game and then clicking run as administrator. It's literally as simple as that. Now, if that didn't fix the issue, you may want to update your graphics card, then check and lower graphics settings in game, which means to update the graphics card and its drivers, depending on which graphics card you have. And then you want to uh, check the graphics inside your game. So inside Valorant and you want to lower the graphic settings in game to lower settings. So you don't want to play on the highest settings, but in the lowest, which may help your loading screen be faster. Okay. And now if that didn't work either, you want to restart your network settings. Now the way you do this is simply by clicking the windows icon down here and typing in CMD. And then you want to open up the command prompt. Okay. There we go, just like I did over here. And then as you can see over here, I listed a few commands you want to run through this command prompt. So the first one is ipconfig slash flush DNS. So simply type that in, press enter. And then after you've done that, you want to type in the second one. So ipconfig slash uh, register DNS and then enter and then ipconfig slash release. And then yet again, enter then ipconfig slash renew, enter, and then net sh winsock reset. Okay. And then once you've done that, you can simply run up the game again and see if that fixed the issue for you. And in case if it didn't, this is the last thing that may help. So you want to delete the manifest debug files win 64 file. And you want to do this by going to your C drive in file explorer and head to riot games folder. Then you want to navigate to Valorant and go inside live. And then you want to find the folder, which is named manifest debug files win 64. And then once you've done that, you want to restart your computer completely and then launch Valorant again. And hopefully this fixed your issue.